here is my alternative radiator agitator so we get a hockey puck a couple of quid off ebay rubber next we've got the drill and then we've got these all we're looking for in that wire wheel set is the um, fixing that goes on the drill so like the, uh, wheel cap this that will be used with the hockey puck to make the agitator also we need some washers and ultimately I needed a longer bolt due to the um, depth of the rubber this is me fiddling around with the washers and, and things like that easy quick and to be honest it probably cost about six pounds maybe to make maybe less depends on what you've got spare in your garage um, I had a wire wheel set spare so uh, I didn't buy it but, uh, but yeah the washers just give extra grip on the um, hockey puck um, just wasn't sure if the, um, the bolt ripped through so Yes, like some uh, washers there. That hockey puck isn't brand new, it's been used on um, uh, car jacks and things, so it's used a bit warm, but just yeah, buy the people. Um, these for agitators cost about for at least 40 to 60 pounds online. Um, right, going back to the hole in the hockey puck, drill it off center. That's the important part. If you do it, drill it in the center, there won't be any hammer action. Um, Drill it off centre. There you go. You can see when the drill bit caught it, it was kind of like, uh, wobbling like anything. This was like a bit of a demo. But yeah, um, I'm filming with one hand, so it's a bit tricky. But um, yeah, I just got my um, nut and bolt set and got a bigger bolt out. Um, then you can see it's slightly longer. So it's nice thread. And then uh, kind of like uh, push that in, a um, bit of fiddling around to uh, get the thing to. Uh, to screw in, but I think uh, you can do this probably under five minutes. Um, I did want an agitator, but yeah, like I said, I didn't want to spend 40 quid. So there we go, pushing through, it's quite hard to push it through. Put in one hand and doing the other bits with one hand. Anyway, it's through, it may not look pretty, but as long as it's solid you can then get the other bit and screw that into position with a washer on top, that's what I did. Make sure we wear safety goggles when you do this kind of stuff and put the um, drill on hammer action. It's a, mine's a, like a, um, it's a battery drill so I'll just put it on speed too but um, you have to be a bit, be a bit careful with the speed that you select. Um, you see it's off centre. It's not, it's a bit wonky but as you see in the demo, it works. Speed 2. I think it's on hammer action. And there you go. Clockwise. If you do it anti-clockwise, it will undo. So on the radiator, I would put this like a, a little small block of wood. Again, I'm doing it with my feet because I'm holding the camera and I've got the drill. Videos. Take care. Bye.